Although it might not seem significant, understanding the type of smile you have is essential to figuring out which cosmetic dental surgeries and treatments are appropriate for you. Following a dental examination, your dentist will describe the type of smile you have. Your facial muscles eventually identify a pattern and produce a particular shape when you smile. There are three various smiles. 1. The impatient smirk. Since face muscles move first to reveal your cuspid teeth in your mouth, they must be dominant to the appearance of a diamond. Approximately one-third of people have a cuspid smile. If your mouth's corners move after you pull your lips up and outward when you grin, you have this type of smile. The height of your lip above your maxillary cuspids is frequently lower than the angle of your mouth's corners. Additionally, with a cuspid grin, your maxillary molars will be below the incisal edge of your central incisors. When you smile, your upper teeth and some of the gums in your upper arch will be most visible. As a result, your dentist will focus more on your upper teeth and gum line when you get a smile makeover. Celebs like Angelina Jolie, Jennifer Aniston, Eva Longoria, and Tom Cruise are the best examples of cuspid fashion. The Commissure Smile The Commissure Smile is the most prevalent sort of smile, and 67% of people worldwide have one. This style of smile is characterized as having a bow form. If you're having trouble picturing this smile, consider Audrey Hepburn, who is among the most well-known individuals to have worn it. When you grin, the corners of your mouth, also referred to as the commissure between your upper and lower lips, Shift up and out and point in the direction of the outer corner of your ears. Someone with a commiseration smile is credited with coining the expression, grinning from ear to ear. Strangely, when you grin like way, you mostly expose your upper teeth without any gum showing. Three, the complicated smile. The complicated grin is the rarest sort of smile, it is thought that just 2% of people have this smile. This smile is uncommon since it calls for the simultaneous engagement of three muscle groups. The lower lip, cuspid, and commissure muscles will all pull downward when you grin like this, forming a double chevron. Even though it resembles a commissure smile, a complicated smile is much wider and typically reveals more upper and lower teeth when it is smiled. Marilyn Monroe and Julia Roberts are well-known representatives of the complicated smile. Unfortunately, complicated grin types present a little bit of a challenge for people seeking smile makeovers. That a complex smile type unfortunately shows more teeth at the top and bottom, making grin makeovers slightly more difficult for those people. If you have a complex grin, a dentist will likely advise lower and upper dental operations. Please smash the like button now and support us by clicking the subscribe button with the bell notification. Please do share and comment your views to understand you better. Thank you. Cheers.